Hi guys, I hope you're doing fine despite this global fuel crisis we are experiencing right now. Grabe ang mahal ng gasolina ngayon, diesel. Sobra. Pero, last na mga gawa. Ganun talaga. All we have to do is endure. Taste, taste lang muna. And you know what's up pa yan, no? Because our guest for Real Drive today is somebody who is not a stranger to adversity. In short, matiisan siya, matyaga, magaling mag-persevere. Biro mo, it took him 12 long years for him to be able to achieve his very first acting award. Pati lang yan. He is also a graduate of the Marine Training. He is a reservist. And hindi biro ang training ng mga Marines. The toughest fighting man in the world. Ano, curious na ba kayo? Sino yung guest na to? Tara, samahan ako. Hello there! Welcome to Real Enrico Lorenzo Macampaneta, better known by his screen name Enzo Paneda, is a finalist in JMA Network's third and fifth season of Starstruck. He is the son of one Pacman party list representative Enrico Paneda and publicist Macy Paneda. He's been active in show business and modeling since 2008. Recently, he won his very first acting award at the Famous Awards for the film he who is without sin as best supporting actor. Right, we're here with uh, Enzo Pineda. How are you? Hi guys, first of all, well, thank you for inviting me. And thank you also for and, uh, I'm really excited for this because it's uh, my first time doing something like this. I first time. you so coach and I find it interesting. I've been watching mga interviews like this before, but more of like international ah. artists. I think there's one with the uh, writing with comedians. That's how busy you are. Busy ako ngayon sa pagkakampaign with my dad. So we all know he's running for uh, one Pac-Man party list. So it's his last turn. And uh, nangako ako sa kanya na itong campaign election sa ito I would uh, stop working for mm -hmm. now para matulog uh, ko siya. Right now, I'm taking up my Culinary Agriculture course in uh, CCA Manila. So it's a farm to the table part of the uh, course. Especially in the pandemic, the big dumb people. And uh, I really like cooking. So I, at least I get to uh, have the best of both worlds. It's a great job. I feel that it's one of the perfect courses. Recently, you want something? Recently, out of my probably yeah, it's my 12th year of year showbiz, finally, I finally won an acting award. So I'm really proud that I was able to win the FAMAS Best Supporting Actor Award this year. So I'm happy because finally, I've got efforts from the especially my fans, my management. I hindi na sa It's one of those moments that you get to feel the worth it yung pinaghirapan mo sa show business. And it's not just for me, it's not just for the money. I'm here for the art. So as much as possible, I want to do uh, projects that have impact. We're here now inside your uh, Nissan Terra. Why the Terra? 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 Why
ang latest entertainment at sa mga paborito niyong celebrities kasama si Pocholo Concepcion sa programang WhatsApp. Makibanding at kwentuhan kasama ang mga kilalang personalidad sa entertainment industry. Sama-sama natin silang kilalanin at silipin ang makulay nilang mundo every Tuesday at 2pm. Kaya sit back and relax lang kayo mga katribu. Hanapin at ilike ang Daily Tribune Facebook page at Tribune Now on YouTube. Dahil sagot na namin ang masayang kwentuhan, dito lang sa What's Up! Binili ko itong Nissan Terra before the pandemic. It was around 2019. And I was really looking for an SUV. SUV. I'm proud to say that this is my second car. This is the second car that I bought during my showbiz career. Mm -hmm. And this year, I'm going to compete with Carlo. Yes, good. 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 Thank you. So, I'm very happy that this year, I'm going to buy it. I'm going to buy it. So, now we are here in the gas station. And, grab it, no? 10 pesos. Today is a Monday, so according to me, it's tomorrow, tataas siya by 10 pesos. So, medyo masakit sa dosa ko. And earlier, I was reading sa Javio na I think our senators are asking our government to pwedeng bawasan yung taxes on fuel or pwedeng isuspend. Kasi alam naman natin, itong gas is our main source of energy when it comes to transportation of anything. Yeah. So, we have some basic commodities that we have. So, hopefully, we can uh, transition in the long run mm -hmm. into a more renewable uh, type of energy. So, I'm hoping in a few years, we yeah. yeah. can have electric cars. Yeah. So, Enzo, diba, recently, you were like that, BCMC and then Emrot yes, Marine yeah. Training uh, Non-stop showbiz update ba ang hanap nyo? Sagot na yan ang aming Tribune Extra Balitang entertainment at lifestyle Mapalocal man o international Meron kami yan Manood at makichika na kasama si Kim Sancha Lunes hanggang biyernes Alas 5 ng hapon sa Tribune News on Q At separate premium nito ng alas 7.30 ng gabi Mapapanood sa Daily Tribune Facebook page at Tribune Now on YouTube. First of all, it's one of the most fulfilling things that I've done in the pandemic and also in my life. Yeah. Because hindi ko expect that. I've always dreamed of serving our country and any other way, mm -hmm. not just by joining the Marines Reservice, Navy to Marines Reservice. Yeah. And I didn't expect. So I'm proud of And it's different from what I saw, especially in graduation when I saw my family, friends, mm -hmm. loved ones. It's different from proud they were when I was able to complete the training. Yeah. To be honest with you, it's more fulfilling than my acting award. Yung acting award, siguro ang tagal ko na siyang gustong makuha mm -hmm. and ma-receive. Na once I was able to receive it, of course, tumang-tuwa ko. But it's not as like when I was wishfully thinking of achieving it before. Mm -hmm. Pero iba rin talaga ang mag makapag-serve ka sa uh, iyong bansa. Mm -hmm. And I'm very proud of it. It was a tough journey. Especially physically, mentally, actually, yeah. Meaning, of course, it's very humbling also. I say, say na muna natin to. Pilipino. Okay lang, go lang, go lang. Thank you, sir. Thank you, boss. 
Sige lang, tuloy-tuloy lang na. <laughs> Sobra nakaproud. And I do believe that I want to encourage everybody to be part of the Navy or Marines Service or any 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 uh, division sa ating uh, military. Okay. Because it teaches you a lot of things. Unang una, especially this pandemic, it, it teaches you how to handle problems, difficult times. It's my first time to become a true leader. May balita ba kayong nasaksiyan sa kalsada, mga katanda? I-share niya sa daily video. Madali lang ang patapasan ng balita. Kailangan lang gawin ay shoot, send, edit, post. Daily video ang custom squad. Katanda sa kalsada, katanda sa balita. Uh, thank you for your time. Thank, thank you for having this interview. It was really worthwhile. Very, it was a humbling and perhaps insightful and opening, an uh, opening uh, interview with you. So thank you. Thank you. Thank you very much. And uh, thank you for inviting me. Eh, lang bubukas yung talk natin. Pero okay lang. 
Um, I would like to say thank you for inviting me. It's uh, definitely a good experience for me. And also, I hope sa ating mga viewers, you get to learn something from this interview. But nevertheless, I'm just really happy to share my thoughts and feelings and opinions about life and in general and also yung mga pinagdadaanan this pandemic. And thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Again, another real life, real life story. Thank you. Thank you. See you next week.